In 1978, Dr. Robert Neerham's lab was studying the relationship between a high-fat diet and heart health with the help of a group of New Zealand white rabbits. After feeding the rabbits a diet high in fat, Dr. Nerim and colleagues analyzed the number of fatty deposits in the rabbits' small blood vessels expecting that all the rabbits would have fatty deposits that were commensurate with their high cholesterol levels. To their surprise, one group of rabbits did not. Befiddled, they explored many alternative hypotheses. Ultimately, they determined that the group of rabbits with far healthier blood vessels was under the care of an especially kind postdoctoral student who treated the animals with love and patience when handling them. They felt the data was just too striking to ignore, so they replicated it. They got the same findings. They published it in Science, which is a very prestigious journal. Kelly Harding, a Columbia University trained board certified psychiatrist, named this phenomenon the rabbit effect in her book, The Rabbit Effect Live Longer, Happier, and Healthier with the Groundbreaking Science of Kindness. Believe in the scientifically proven power of kindness. Kindness builds social connectedness. Here's a quote from her book. Kindness is not a cure-all. Bad things still happen to good and kind people. However, all the way down to ourselves and up to the larger fabric of society, kindness serves to build strength and coping and promotes health.